How's it going guys? So um, today we're going to the Fort Lauderdale Beach because there is a awesome air show over there and uh, um, so we're looking at getting a portable chair over to the beach and I bought this one from Costco. This is Cascade Mountain Tech. Um, they just started selling those at our local Costco here in Miami. Before this they had a beach chair for sale. I think it's from Tommy Bahamas. Um, it's very bulky um, and uh, it's very it's it's a lot more heavy than this one, and it's not as comfortable because I I was trying to sit on the chair to test how comfortable it is so we can spend uh, an extended period of time on the beach. And obviously this one is designed for uh, using when you are going hiking. It never showed anything on the beach maybe near the stream um, that's one possibility but um, it is comfortable and it's the exact same price as the Tommy Bahamas beach chair that was on sale for, at Costco this one right now is $39 I believe um, the Tommy Bahamas retails for 39 but sometimes it goes on sale for like 29 and I believe they go on sale because they, they are stopping to carry that chair so it was $29 for a while. We bought that chair, it's not comfortable. We return it and then we found this chair, okay? Um, instantly comfortable the moment I started sitting on this because the cool thing is this chair is suspended. So it's like a hammock. So it's like you're sitting on a hammock and if you look, it's extremely compact, okay? This is like, fits in like two and a half palms of my hand. And it's also extremely light. The Tommy Bahamas chair is plastic. It's got a carrying handle on the back and it's got very bulky plastic like arm holder over on the two sides. Not good. So let's just open this. And obviously, once we finish the unboxing, I'll take it to the beach and show you guys how well this works on the beach as well. So we can have a like a better idea on the comfortness of this chair. Okay. So we're gonna do this review with friend of the Ori over there um, yeah right off the box it's very nice that it comes with a um, a carrying bag and this bag obviously one velcro you open this up and it seems like it's kind of rolled inside so let's take it out All right, some dry pack over there and so this is the chair and uh, you're gonna roll this out and it also comes with a little pillow that you can put somewhere on the top, right there, okay? So the main compartment of the chair is this little metal piece over there. And this is like the hammock, kind of the, uh, the seating hammock area, okay? So let's try to assemble this. And this is my first time, so uh, I don't know what to expect. So let's, let's try to assemble this really quick. Okay, obviously it's easier than I thought, okay? If you look at those tubes, uh, they're all interconnected. So all you have to do when you unfold this by uh, unscrewing the Velcro is those tubes is gonna try to stretch into shape. And once it's into shape, I believe you can just very quickly put the um, this little thing on top, right? So as you can see, it starts to unfold and you can put everything in here, just like even with one hand, right? So everything just goes in and I, I'm literally doing this with one hand, which is quite amazing. Okay, um, almost there. All right. And just getting them in place by just shaking, literally just shaking. And I didn't do anything, I just shaked. Looks like everything's in one piece. Um, obviously this is the bottom part, okay. So this is how the chair is gonna sit on the uh, on the beach. Here you go. So um, actually quite easy. Um, all you have to do, there are four corners that you need to plug your tube in here. So just find those four corners and of course use your two hands. And on the back, somewhere here, somewhere here. And once it's assembled, um, you're ready to sit on top. And let me tell you, it's uh, it's actually quite comfortable, okay? Quite comfortable. Very nice. Also, don't forget your little pillow thing. So you can 
change the height just a little bit you can get maybe a little higher somewhere here so you get nice neck support or you can go a little lower if you want uh, but that's pretty much it and when you're done um, obviously just pull the corner and it will pop off and you can roll it and put everything like this thing of course automatically detaches and there's a rubber piece holding all the tubes together so just put them together and velcro it and that's pretty much it um, I think it's gonna be a very nice chair to use on the beach today but we'll find out soon okay so I'll see you guys in the next section So we're back from the beach and uh, uh, with this high back chair uh, from Cascade uh, Mountain Tech and uh, so we bought two chairs total and I, I think I unboxed both uh, when we were at the beach but we're keeping one for sure and again the chair is extremely comfortable however we have to return one or either get this one exchanged because let me show you uh, what is wrong during our use on the on the first time use okay and on the beach obviously keep in mind this is not designed for beach use but we did use it on the beach and it was fine for the most part except when I take this out let me show you guys roll it out and you'll see what I'm talking about so um, the fabric part perfectly fine very comfortable um, to sit on and again it's designed for compactness. It's not a very big chair. So if you have a larger body build, say like if you're over 180 pounds, this chair might be a little small for you, okay? Um, just keep that in mind. So the problem we have with this is the hardware. And uh, there are, I'll show you really quick, there are four of those foot um, that is supposed to go into the ground or at least going to the sand. Uh, the one with the foot attached works perfectly fine. However, during our use, we very soon realized that there are supposed to be four foot and we are only left with uh, three foot total, okay? Check it out. So one, two, three, and the fourth one is missing. And if you look closely, there are some sort of like glue that is supposed to keep that fork uh, that little rubber feet over there so it doesn't dig further into the sand which is is missing after first assembled we realized that after i i realized that i keep sinking into the sand i was like what's going on and i looked down and obviously this is the one that's for the front part is missing and we tried to dig into the sand try to find that piece but it's very very hard almost impossible so we just left without that piece and this is something that I want to show you. Like if you go to a sandy area, make sure you don't lose those little feet. And, uh, um, or I think better yet, you should just glue this, take it out if it's removable. But uh, I mean, obviously it's not. It's like very glued onto there. This one, you can see the glue marks and it's missing. So um, clearly it's not glued very well. Keep that in mind. If your feet is missing, I, I guess you can either contact the manufacturer. They should send you a new one, like, very fast uh, if not just return to Costco and exchange for a different one and I'm sure they'll be happy to do that uh, this is again the only quirk or the only problem that we had with this cascade high back chair okay otherwise we enjoyed it we were at the beach for almost the whole day 
and it held up pretty well. The little pillowy thing is nice. Even if you want to lay down like on your towel, you can take this and use it as a little pillow if you want. Otherwise, super easy to take down, super easy to assemble, and extremely compact for carrying around, okay? And everything fits into this little tiny bag, which is amazing. So um, would we still recommend this chair? Absolutely. Like if you are fairly small, if you have a fairly small body build and you value compactness, lightweight and easy of assembly, you should definitely give this chair a try um, compared to the, um, the other one that Costco sells. I think it's the Tommy Bahamas high back chair. Um, that one is very cumbersome and it does the exact same job as this one, okay? Uh, and uh, you're just gonna be carrying more weight for the same purpose, all right? I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please do hit the like button or subscribe to my channel. I will eventually, of course, have more similar uh, Costco-related items coming out or Costco-related reviews coming out for you guys. So make sure to subscribe. And again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.